guys, what's up? This is Shirt Talk and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is about the Seraph Gate, this difficulty called Neither. This was what we got from the last update. There's only two ones to be cleared on this video series. This one is the black. Let's just start this one. And I'll be talking about how I'm using my squad for the stages. I'm focusing on having my inventory Hakuri next it, getting as much as attack as she can. And then I have my other characters here trying to equip a 6 star weapon max set on each one of them. Also trying to use my characters with orbs so they get even more status from be using unique orbs, more defense as well. And then uh, I'm trying to just get the best squads on party 3 and party 4. And you can use all your Arcton skills with your characters before you switch out to your squads. So this makes for the best strategy. You can also Try to maximize your Valkyrie or God to unleash Purify attacks on every wave. This is the best strategy I found. It. So let's just try it with the squad and deal with this one here. It's just for floors. And we can kind of uh, just use this to get more crystals and make it as fast as possible. The bonus is already on the max spot, also on the max. So we can simply unleash modification attacks or just action skills. Prefer to unleash action skills here so all enemies are down. It's even faster than modification attacks most of the time. Nice, we just got our Beatles. Beatles can appear on the boss stages as well. So they are down. And more experiences to the squad. Okay, let's just keep going. I was trying to make some changes on this run. Uh, as you see, when you switch squad squads, you have this party bonus here that makes the appearance of special enemies higher. At least is what it says. And well, I will just try to skip the party to change. You just try try to change to party four, just to know if it still can get the max bonus, just for science, because there's only three party uh, bonus, it makes no, no, no sense to just having uh, these changes. Three bonus, four squads, doesn't make more sense. <laughs> Nice, we got a beater again. I didn't get two beetles on a single wave, so uh, on a single floor, so I don't think this is possible. Let's just finish. Okay, we got, uh, got them at least one level with each one of our characters. You see by uh, changing my squad again here... No. Yeah, we'll have to change four times. So yeah, you have to shoot, make four squads. It doesn't three squads won't ever make it. The max bonus is the best thing you can do, so you can have more chances of getting special enemies. But uh, uh, this is my sixth run of this Nether stage, and I still didn't get this special encounter. Uh, even with the max bonus, it's still very low chance. <laughs> Oh, 
これで終わり手加減はしないスタンダードスタンダードカウンターオフィンスペシャルバブルイズ always survive because he's very strong to ice Okay. That was the last squad. This is my best squad. I can't die with this squad. Nice got uh, the heroes. Last stage, just hope for uh, the. <laughs> no, we didn't get the special encounter yet. Bonus on max, purification attack. The experience is at least uh, very fine. Still no 7 star orb, the chances are very very low. But that's it guys, we just finished our uh, second to last run. The last stage we need to run is the yellow one and the best one. If you want to just farm this, focus on the yellow because it has Drain Orb and Drain Orb is the best uh, passive skill from an orb that you can get. Well, that's it. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't and we see each other on the next video. Bye!